Afternoon folks, I'm Dave Canterbury with Self Reliance Outfitters and the Pathfinder School. So we've got this great bush camp set up, but really what we don't have is a place to hang gear. We don't have trees that just happen to have branches sticking out of them. We don't want to drive nails. So we're going to make hangers for our tree. Very simple, five minute project. We need two forks or more, however many you want to decide to use for the gear you want to hang. We're going to make a couple seven notches, wrap some cordage around the tree, and we're going to have a place to hang all the gear we need. Stay with me. Okay, pretty simple stuff. What we want to do is we want to cut into this at the top here, about halfway into the material, in two places depending on the weight we're going to hang on this thing. And then we just need to take our knife and push cut those seven notches out very similar to the way we did on our pot crane. They don't have to be real, real deep. It's just enough to hang cordage off of, basically, or for the notch to hang on cordage. We'll make another one just like that, and we'll be ready to rock. Okay, I've got two pieces of cordage, 10, 12 feet long here, just utility cords. One's got a loop in the end of it with enough of a tail to use to tie out. I've got my hanger. Now what I'm gonna do is set one of them on the ground for a second here, come around my tree at the height I want. I've got my cordage hanked, so it's not hanging and dangling all over the place on me. I can get this exactly where I want it by pulling that tight. Come around, put my second hanger on the tree, overlapping the line one time, just like that. And just continue to go around that tree three or four times until I've got some tail left here, or enough tail left to tie off to this one. And then I can just do a left over right, right over left square knot. And I'm good. Now I've got to wrap one more piece of cordage around the tree at this next level. Again, we just need an overhand with a loop and some room to tie off. And the reason we are using two lines is in case we want to put heavier gear on here, it will give it more support. And I'm just using a longer length of cord because I don't want to cut the cordage just for no reason. Keep these lashings fairly tight around this tree. And we get to where we're going to run out again. We'll just tie off in a reef knot right over left, left over right. We'll call that good. Tuck our tail up inside. And now. We should have a place here easy enough to hang any gear that we happen to be wearing. We can now hang up out of the way and off the ground. All right, guys, I appreciate you joining me for another quick segment in our five minutes to better bushcraft, making hangers for our gear. Very simple project. I appreciate your views. I appreciate your support. I thank you for everything you do for our school, for our family, for our business all of our sponsors, instructors, affiliates, and friends, and I'll be back with another video as soon as I can. Thanks, guys.